Hello, this is Broy, and welcome back to the episode of Let's Play Motorsport Manager. And we are in a very unusual place for us. Um, job security is uneasy. Um, our relationships with our uh, pit crew, or not pit crew, our uh, mechanics is not good. I mean, this is weird. I, I'm not familiar with this ground um, of what am I, staff. Like, we're not, we're not unlocking nurse at the moment. We're not unlocking push to the limit, both of which are very critical to our strategy that we run with, which is not really worry about maxing out our parts conditions and just just run with it um but that is something that we may have to put a little bit more time into our parts or, or figure something out because we are you know i don't know we're having some issues here and um the chairman's unhappy with us everybody's unhappy with us this has been kind of a a weird start i knew that we were being aggressive on our our placement that we wanted to go for but i didn't think they'd start grading us on that placement three races in i thought we'd be able to grow into that that placement um which is apparently not the case so we're in a very bad place overall we've got to figure out a way to get this flipped around somehow i don't know what that's going to look like um we'll figure something out you didn't quite have the pace today is the car letting you down or are the drivers finally get the best out of it i'm the driver or i'm the manager i have to take the black um Happiness is even lower, obviously, than what you're going to do. Um, let's go look at the pit crew. Did he do anything, like, smart here? I'm worried that they, like, this... You know what? I'm not convinced that you're smart enough to do what you need to do. No offense, dude, but I have my doubts in you. Um, like, for one, you're using some really bad... Maybe you just haven't hired the new ones yet. But I'm, I'm feeling like... Yeah. Okay, for one, we definitely need to put you up there, probably. Um, you're a really good rear jack, so we're going to do those two. Um, the fuel guys look okay. I don't care about the fixing guys and the burnout guys, obviously, which is interesting. Um, this guy's a good tire guy. This guy's a good tire guy. Actually, I should be looking at the mistake percentages. Okay, so far, so good. Um... I guess I'll drop the burnout guys down for a second in a, in a second. Refueling. Okay, here's a... Okay, that's a good refueler, but low... I mean, he's tired, so... Uh, I'm actually going to bring you down as a refueler. Um, and swap one of you two 13s in there. So we'll swap you in, and we'll swap you in as the other refueler. Okay, that'll work. And then as far as the two fixers... Like, what's burnout compared to, like... I mean, usually mistake percentage is how fatigued they are, but burnout is, I guess, a little bit different. Um, we could hire somebody else, but I'm really... We're in a place now where we really got to stop spending money. Honestly, I'm just going to pop you in there. It's really fine, because we're still going to maintain the goal of not fixing anything. Because if we have to fix something, I think we're out of the race anyway, at that point. Uh, car repair finished. Uh, let's go look at our car. Improved parts. We are improving the reliability of this. Um, we'll let that go for a couple days. Okay. Um... Okay, so we're above 70% at least, so let's lock that out of there. We're going to go full-on performance for now. Um, and I guess we really got to start doing some more stuff with these. Definitely the ones that are below 70. Okay, that'll work for now. What are we... What are we designing? Oh, gearbox. Okay, yeah, yeah. Um, which does mean that we actually probably don't need to focus on... Yeah, we're not focusing on this other gearbox at all, so that's okay. Okay, we'll go with this for now. So we did scout a driver. Uh, when you're putting the chest together for next season, could you be a bit more, think a bit more about the car's fuel efficiency? We will think about that. All right. 
Totus Carruthers. Okay, no trait to trait, so we don't care about you. Really, we're just trying to chase down another a good pay driver or something like that that we can we can pick up maybe. It's just at least a little bit better on the focus, so we can get a little bit more focus uh, for tuning the car in and stuff like that. Um, let's see here. Everything else looks good here. All right, we got to do something better here. Come on, guys. We got to get this one going this time around. I'm still going to go with ninth or above. I feel like that's still good for us. I mean, if we don't get ninth or above, then we got, again, much bigger problems than the fact that we didn't miss our, we missed our sponsor objective. Part fitting. Uh, I'm going to go with the parts as is. I think they're going to be fine. Oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on. We got to get this one. No silly mistakes, at least. If we miss it because of other reasons, it's fine, but at least no silly mistakes. <laughs> I like that it tells us, being fired is no big deal. Championships will carry on without you until you find a new team. Pretty sure if Breuer ends up on any team other than Breuer Racing, you've got a problem. Um, so we're going to go loud. We're going to go Frankie. Get the car set up. Change this. Load setup. Go to Tondala. Tondala, Tondala, Tondala. Uh, there we go. Tondala. It's tr track A, but it's going to be close enough, I believe. Tire choice. Softs, it's fine. Your Tondala as well. Do you have Trent Tondala, track B? No, we're good. Track A is going to be close enough. Um, tire choice. Softs as well. I'm lock those in. Take practice. Come on. Honestly, that last race, the practice was already bad enough, so that should have been our first clue. Um, qualifying, yes. Tire choice, okay, everything's good. Um, send you out, send you out. Qualifying is good. Go. Come on, let's get this one better this time, guys. Come on. We need a big, huge bounce back race. All right. Great, great, good. Not bad. All right. Um, I don't know really much we can do here. And then good. Something like that. At least we got one excellent here on this side. All right. Um, let's see here. Maybe something like that. Uh, didn't get any better, unfortunately. If anything, it might have gotten worse. Yeah, it did a little bit. Great. Still great. So we'll kind of push that one a little bit further. Excellent. Still excellent. Moving from great to good, though. So I'm guessing it's right there on the line. And you dropped down a lot. I'm going to use this setup and look at this one as a basis. Went from good to great. Goes back a little bit more that direction. Went from great to great. I don't know. I'm not sure if the handling will be on the line or not, but we'll see what it does. And went from good to okay. So perhaps it is also on the line this direction.
There we go. Lock that one in. Um, I'm actually going to have you start getting us some race trim. I know it's not going to be much, but let's get you doing something productive. <laughs> and uh, we'll let you lock in the qualifying trim just a little bit more. We may actually settle at two on the qualifying. Honestly, I don't think it's going to make enough difference. Just go all the way up to three. That way we can get three on the racing. Since we don't have nurse and we don't have the other thing, we're going to have to take the good racing trim. So that's becoming a little bit more important. Okay, so putting it right on the line apparently does not make any difference whatsoever. So, but we're still great. I have no idea where it is then. If all three of these are great, that is a big stretch. Wow, that is a big old stretch. I may just not try and chase that one. And just try and chase this one just a little bit more. And be happy with that. That other one's going to be hard, I think. Man. Honestly, I'm, I'm tempted to just take the 96 and just run with it. You know, I am. This is, this is, we're missing it by something. And I just want to get him out there doing some stents, getting us locked in here. Bring you, oh, you are coming in anyway. Uh, we did get a little bit higher on the qualifying than I meant to, but that's all right. All right, send out stints. Uh, we're going to move over to racing, nine laps, tire choice. Uh, we'll leave it on softs because we would like to lock it in, that in for the qualifying. That's fine. See if we can get um, some medium stuff locked in. I didn't realize your tires were low. I was not paying attention to you. It's all right, buddy. Sorry. Tire choice. Medium, stint, race. You guys should be able to go the rest of the time. Cool. Uh, I don't think we'll get three. Um, I don't, yeah, I don't think we're going to get three. We'll try, obviously. I mean, it's not like I'm going to swap them or anything like that, but hopefully we'll at least get two. Yeah, I guess I didn't swap you over to racing in time. I really want, meant, wanted to get the three at least. Um, but we didn't even get that. Oh, well. We'll go with it as is. Alrighty, come on. We need this qualifying to look good. Alright, so you're going to go qualifying, I guess, soft tires. You're going to go sweet spot soft tires, I suppose. Everything else here is fine. Simulate session. I mean, it's possible if we were actually running this ourselves, we'd do better, but... Uh, I'm okay with simulating it. I mean, I wish this ninth would count, but obviously we got to finish the whole rest of them. All right, come on, guys. Two more, two more goes of this. Oh, not looking good. We're not even going to qualify here. Wow. You get ninth on one and then you can't even qualify. Oh, there we go. Jumped up at the last second. That was interesting. Of 
Come on, Lyle. Hold on. Just ninth place. Come on. Let's get at least a little bit of a consolation prize here. Get some money for, for us, buddy. Get some money. Okay, cool. We held on. We got our money. That is, that is what matters. Alrighty, pit stop, I guess. We'll go race trim, I guess, because that'll last the whole race. Race trim, and I guess soft. Although I have my doubts that you're actually be able to do anything with it. You're going to have to start with soft set, at least, so I guess there's that. Um, go crazy at first, but we'll probably make sure we pay very close attention to swap you guys off of that as soon as we can, or as soon as we feel like we should. Go ahead and auto those for now as well. Right, just give me one lap on the high speeds, and then we'll drop you both back down for everything else. And we got we can't be running the engine full tilt either because we've got to we got to preserve our uh, kind of repair stuff. High push, high push. Settle in for now. Temperature's pretty low, uh, so we should be able to maybe stay on push for a little bit on the tires. That'll be good. I'll keep it on high on the engine. It's not usually too bad. Yeah, let's go ahead and settle you into... Neutral on the tires. Um, I'll put neutral on the tires for you too as well. Come on, Lau. Keep, keep fighting, buddy. Keep fighting. Oh, so close. <laughs> the sponsor objective was, was tripping out a little bit for a second there. Yeah, we're still burning through our tires faster than anybody else, though. I'm going to go down to conserve. We'd really like to get this one more lap just fine. We should be okay on. Right, go ahead and pit. Um, I mean, the only thing we have that's boosted is soft, so... But we just can't afford to do that. So go to mediums. Fill it up. We're going to have to have two more pits again here, no matter what we do. So... I mean, do we do one more set of sauce for... No, that's just not, not good. Such a performance difference, though. We will only get five laps out of this. But that would at least get us back within range of only needing one more pit after that. So, I guess it'll have to be... And we're gonna go. We're gonna go all out fast. See if our pit crew can can save us a bit. No signs of rain or anything, so we're gonna be good for this race, at least as far as that's concerned. Come on, pit crew! You guys gotta save us here. Overtake for one lap, and then we'll bring it back down. Um, I want to drop you down to conserve and be ready to pitch you this next lap. All right, so you can go ahead and go to mediums, barely. Uh, but I think you can be okay with the mediums. Because, yeah, we're just barely... If we keep it simple on the fuel, we should be able to only do one more pit stop for you. It's going to be close. But I think we can do it. Oh, you did cross the pit. So we're going to go to high neutral. See if we can preserve these tires as long as possible. Mm. 
really taking it easy this lap, this race, which still doesn't feel good, I'll be honest. I'd rather be a little bit more aggressive than we're being, but not much we can do about it. All right, I'm not going to go above high here. I'm going to go ahead and push, though, and we're going to have to drop you down to neutral um, pretty quickly after this, though. After we get you up for at least one full lap. Alright, medium. Uh, we'll leave it on push on the tires for now. Uh, you're going to be okay for the moment. you got one more lap in you. But we do need to go ahead and pit you. I mean, I'm going to let you go all the way around again. Uh, we got to do the pit. All right, but that does bring you within range that we needed. Um, which is fine. Uh, but we do make sure to change the tires. I always keep, keep trying to forget that. Uh, we will go to mediums and pit strategy. Keep it on fast. Really see if our pit crew can shave off a few seconds here for us. Drop you down to neutral on the tires. Just kind of let you settle in. Do your thing. Right. Medium push. That guy just went right past us with his, uh, he was using his charge very nicely. Alright, gonna go medium, push. Yeah, we're just not burning through fuel fast enough compared to how we're um, using up our tires, to be honest. I'd like to push a little bit more to kind of keep the temperature in it, but I don't think we can. Just got to settle in and just hope that we can we can make it. Lao should be okay, but I don't know about Chi. I'm just I'm worried about her not getting in the... Like the timing's just not going to work out right because she's just burning through her tires so fast. There's no way she's making six more laps on the tires that she has left. I don't think she's making three more laps on the tires she has left. Seventeen laps remaining. We need to get at least, what, four laps out of her? I don't see it happening, but we're going to try. She's in tenth place. We're still we're way off of the top five, and we're definitely off of you know, our sponsor. It's just... I don't know. Losing Nurse. And losing... Because uh, otherwise I'd be pushing a lot harder right now. Maybe accepting another pit stop. You know, whatever. No big deal. Losing those is just really hurting us. Oh, yeah. She's, she's going to be basically flat tire here in a second. I need her to go one more lap. I mean, it just... Has to. To even have a remote chance here. But even then, I don't, don't think it'll be quite enough. And Lau is so far behind everybody else. Alright, we can at least schedule your pit now. Um, and we'll bring you out on the hards, I suppose, at this point. Because obviously we know the mediums aren't going to last long enough. Fuel options, we just got to fill it up and hope that we can squeeze out one extra lap. You're going to be 12.75, you need 14. So a lap and a quarter is what we got to come up with. It's sad too. She actually is in ninth place now, but she's not gonna be able to hold on to it. Mm -hmm. 
And we go a little bit harder on the tire because we got plenty there, but we can't do nothing to the fuel. Fuel's got to be right at the yellow. Yellow is at least 90%, so theoretically we should have be able to make up the ground we were hoping to. Let's check here. We're going to be at... What's that? 13 laps remaining? Yeah, 13 laps remaining. Still a little bit less than the fuel to go, to make up. Um, allow... I'd really like you to go one more lap, to be honest. And I'm going to, obviously, because I'm past that lap thing. I'll go ahead and schedule it now, though. Uh, we can definitely stay, stay out on mediums. Fill this up. I guess it's just a little bit more. And everything else is just going to have to stay the same. I don't know. I'm not, not feeling it, but we'll see what we can do. Especially since we can't push anything. Like, literally cannot push anything. So there's just no way for us to get back into this. She's going to have 10 laps left when she crosses the line. Really? Did she make up that much? Oh, no, no. She's got 11 laps left. Sorry. She'll have 10 laps left when she crosses the line this time. All right. You can push a little bit on both. Barely. Yeah, she's making some of it back. Not much. She's making some of it back. I don't see us getting into top nine by any stretch, but, you know, maybe top 12. But that's not going to get us any points or anything. Man, this world, the world championship is so hard considering, I mean, obviously the other championships at least get points for lower down. So there's a way to kind of work your way into it. Not getting any points for anything below top five is crazy hard. Thirteen. Still a lot of fuel to make up on. Twelve. Get on his excess fuel. Got to at least place top ten to start getting some of our happiness with our. I don't know. I, I, I'm worried that if we don't get top three effectively that we'll never get any of the happiness back. Like that may be... I did not think... Again, I didn't think that um, saying top three meant we, they expected us to be top three from the very beginning of the season. Um, so it's a little little frustrating, I'm not going to lie, because um, I feel like we can get back into it, but losing our chairman's happiness, you know, we may lose our job before we have a chance. So it's a bit unfortunate. Because we're going to go pretty aggressive on part improvements, but we can't get uh, the happiness back with people. Especially if our mechanics are judging us by that same level. Like saying, oh, you're not top three, you know, so I'm not going to be happy with you either. I mean, if that's the case, then um, if that's what's causing them to be unhappy with us, then yeah, I've shot myself in the foot doubly so. But it's uh, because that's losing their reputation, their happiness is, is a big time killer for us. Still excess fuel over here, which is interesting. I don't see Chi passing anybody else, so that's, that is what it is. Three laps remaining when she crosses the line. She's actually going to be right on uh, being able to uh, have just enough fuel. Yeah, I think we're going to be fine. We'll just leave it as is, and I think we'll be, we'll be able to coast into this, most more or less. Uh, okay, we're going to have to ignore that. We've only got two laps left. I hate to retire again just with two laps to go. Come on now. That nurse thing, we count on it so much. Oh my goodness. I 
I'm about to say excess fuel. I'm not failing it too believably. Oh, because we got lapped. I was not paying attention to that. Bomber. All right. Oh, man. This is not a good season for us. We're doing worse this season than we did last season. That's crazy. Like, not even just by a little bit. Like, by a lot. Like, what have we done? I mean, I know I'm, I've mismatched some races, but... But, really? We're just not even close is the problem. Mismanaged or not, we're just not getting the performance I was expecting. Maybe some of the chassis uh, ch decisions that I made um, are not, not playing well with us, you know. Uh, I think I had a choice, a chance to get better fuel efficiency, things like that. Maybe some of those things are, are hurting us. Uh, I do think, actually, didn't we have like a gear system last year that, that got us really good fuel efficiency? Maybe maybe I got so used to that that it, I'm not I'm not, you know... I'm not used to this new one. We're still just only a couple points off. Like, just get some points somewhere and we'd be fine. We'd be in the top three and everybody would be happy with us for now. Why are you dropping down so much? I mean, I'm not even ro Really? Yeah, we've shot ourselves in the foot big time this season with the whole expectations here I, I did not expect it to hit us that hardly like that that hard like that that is surprising because we're not that bad off we're two points behind third place um it looks like we're in sixth place like it's like oh no, it's so bad but we're not that far off if people would just be a little bit happier right now we could you know Okay, well, we may be fired next race, which is really, really weird. And honestly, if that happens, I will just restart the season. Because um, I should still have that save, maybe, I hope. Um, and um, because that's just, I don't know. Honestly, that's, I did not realize that's how this would work. That because we're not there from the very beginning of the season, everybody's mad at us and nobody races well or nothing could happen so that is not how i expected this to work i just ex i expected this to be an end of the season go not a hey start off the season third place and stay there um so that that is uh that's unfa un, 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 un um what am i trying to say unfortunate <sighs> no i'm actually gonna reject the interview i don't really care <laughs> i'll be honest not in the mood oh i guess i should be putting a gun here all right, we're going to put it kind of here. Uh, that we may be restarting the season next uh, episode. I'm not going to restart, obviously, the entire everything. And I'm not going to switch teams. That that's that defeats the whole point of the series. So if uh, if we do get fired next get next race, I will restart the season. Uh, I may have to finish off like, the last race of last season or something like that if I have to pick, find one of those saves. But we will um, we'll restart the season with different expectations, I guess. I do appreciate you watching, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you, and goodbye.